Storekeeper! Yes? We don't keep much. You'll be lucky if you keep anything. Requisition order. Salt, tea, sugar, tobacco, grain. Where's your storeroom? In the back. What about payment? Just see the paymaster and he'll pay you. He'd have nothing left. They can't do this to us, can they? Mr. Hawkins. It's all as legal as you please. Hey, Mr. Hawkins? Just ask the paymaster and he'll pay you. Nice, fresh paper money. Legal tender, isn't that so, Mr. Hawkins? Of course, you can't buy anything with it and you can't eat it, or smoke it, or make tea with it, but you have no legal complaint, just the same. Isn't that so, Mr. Hawkins? One case of best imported Indian tea. No matter what they take over, your crops, your livestock, your liquor, even your wives, it's all in the name of the law. There's only one way to change laws of that sort. Get rid of the people who make them. And that's illegal, isn't it, Mr. Hawkins? Mr. Hawkins has no answer. But some of our countrymen think they've found one. There's been some fighting, or so they tell me, and... Ah, that's no game for pious men, good citizens, law-abiding lawyers. Nah. As you hold such strong views, why don't you stop talking and do something? Me? I've no respect for any sort of law. So what do I care what kind's enforced? Hmm? Hmm? Time we must remember. We are all made of good and evil. Each man believes himself to be in the right. And that man's enemy has the same beliefs. But when this conflict is over, we can be sure of one thing. Justice will prevail. God cannot be set aside.